are you guys thinking of next you know the album's out you know yes uh, it is the album is out so i will we have another uh cerulean sunday collaboration oh uh, yeah. yeah i yeah i hope so i mean we're we've been ta- like i said before we've been talking about writing um mm. and doing stuff like that um so that's what I think both of us agree. That's what we'd really like to do. Yeah. I think if you, you know, we haven't discussed this, so I'm not trying to railroad the discussion or anything, but (laughs) no, no, I I think about it all the time. I have a list of notes, uh, you know, a note in my phone with all these songs that I want to cover. And I know that she's got like a playlist, a huge playlist of songs she wants to cover. Yes. And I was thinking like maybe another six song project would be a good, uh, you know, you're just Whatever. totally speaking my language. I mean, uh, my yeah, that's I think there's something about sort of like a, you know, like just it's almost like I mean, I'll just give away like the secret that I imagine it is, you know, it's like, you know, just different packaging than we're used to. Mm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. you know, there's no pressure anymore for us to make. 12 song 13 song albums yeah. you know and i really enjoyed your six song ep you know Thanks. i mean and like you know the time stamps can be different the you know the tour schedule or whatever can be different the, mm-hmm. you know yeah all, and every, i mean w- you know. sorry <laughs> no 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 I, everything to do with presentation basically can be different yeah right yeah so yeah. Uh, but please, what, what were you going to say? I was just going to say that with the um, covering stuff, I um, it's an avenue I've never gone down or cons- at least in the recording side of things, you know. Um, okay. But I think that I'm a little really... surprised to hear that because I just totally jammed out on your SoundCloud, which has no. A bunch well, of <laughs> yeah, I mean, of course, I've done it. covers and stuff on there, but I mean, like, mm. I mean, like, as in releasing something, right, um, right. I've never, I've never even really thought about that, but um, I, I oh. love the idea of of kind of just changing something up, you know, and making it something different. Like, I've been really enjoying um. I don't know if either of you have, have heard, but that there's like, you know how on social media and on TikTok and stuff like that, there's trending sounds. So yeah. there's one artist called uh, Pop Goes Ambient. Oh, and wow. He's done, I think the main two ones are um, As It Was by Harry Styles and Yellow by Coldplay. So he just takes oh, it yeah. and he makes it incredibly ambient. And I, it's so awesome. It's so cool. It's a totally different song. I wow. love it. So it would be cool to take something and just make it something completely different, you know? Yeah. And, and we have That's like, true. A, like Emma's a, an awesome high powered vocalist, but she's, she's I agree. Musical, you know, and we can uh, like, I, man, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just tired, but I but- like, I'm like really chilling out with my sounds these days. And um, I mean, I, I like some, some upbeat tunes. I I do produce dance music, but like, oh, wow. I, I just want to go the chill direction myself. And so I, I feel like taking yes. a lot of these high powered tunes that are out there and then just mellowing them out and, and wow. adding like jazz elements, R and B and wow. soul. Mm-hmm. that that's a great direction to go and it's always a fun turn on a tune i think wow you know um you guys are i i look forward to you guys coming back very very soon <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah man this got, is fun it is fun and uh you know i just i want to uh, try and find a way to just make a couple slightly shorter episodes just so people can see that I'm I have some sort of restraint I guess I don't know you know it's like um but and uh and I want people to really kind of um like get to know you guys and 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 not sort of uh I don't know I you know I'm I guess I'm just still you know it's like I'm experimenting with with time just like you guys do right so 
Hey, what was um, your favorite tune on the the Christmas oh, yeah. EP? Well, I that is a tough call. I think it's between Santa Baby and Walking in the Air. Yeah, yeah. Sure. <laughs> I guess you did kind of answer cool. that before. Yeah. yeah. No, no, it's cool. It's cool. Actually, um, I've got a couple more for you guys for sure. I mean, I have way more than a couple, but um, <laughs> I'm trying to trying to convince you guys to come back again. That's what, that's oh, what oh. I'm up to. <laughs> so, um, uh, let's start. You know, I haven't asked you guys about food at all. So I am curious. <laughs> I am genuinely curious, actually. Um, you know, do you guys cook at all? Do you do you figure out, you know, what 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 are your go to meals? You know, you're tired. It's Wednesday or something. You know, <laughs> you maybe you have to maybe literally you have to play a show or something later. You know, like, what are you going to do? How do yeah. you figure out food? And uh, you guys are in St. Petersburg, Florida. So let's try and shout out a restaurant in the area. Okay. Mm. Well, I do. I cook a lot. Uh, mm. I cook almost every meal. Um, so I don't, I kind of rotate between like chicken, beef and fish. And sometimes like, I don't know, some beans or something like that. Right. Um, so I actually borrowed Mark's um, <laughs> instant pot thing, uh, his um, pressure cooker, pressure cooker air fryer. Thing. Yeah. And so I've been slow cooking things a lot. Wow. Um, so I'll just like throw everything in there in the morning before I go to work and then nice. come back and I've got very tender oh, beef or something like that. It's the best. So, yes. yeah. so that's, been, that's yeah. been great. I, I love that. The reason she's borrowing it is that I... I live in a van right now. Oh and, yeah, um, yeah. I'm so you're it. making dance music in a van in Florida. Uh, yeah, that's I right. just want to just establish that <laughs> for any listeners who might be definitely curious. <laughs> yeah, it gets, it gets hot. I, okay, so well, I, I've got a lot that I could say about that, but yeah, I I can't cook in the van. Um, I love cooking myself, but I um, of course don't have the opportunity right now. And, um, like I used to have two smokers when I was in, um, oh, Wyoming and, wow. and Seattle and I would, my favorite thing to make would be pulled pork. I'd throw a couple of, uh, and a pork smoker, shoulders. huh? Yeah. Um, oh, that's just great. Give it like 12 to 14 hours and, uh, get it up to temp and then it's incredible. Um, in Wyoming, also, no less. Yeah. And I could make some monster ribs. Those were my favorite things to make. But like, if I'm just trying to cook something up to make myself feel better or whatever, um, give me a cast iron skillet and I'll make a, a hell of an egg sandwich. <laughs> all right, all right. Yeah. Um, let's talk about merch real quick. Let's let's uh, let's find a way to get Mark a, a good uh, uh, outdoor equipment thing. You know, uh, please. You know, you guys got some shirts. You got uh, band camp. Let's let's drive some sales here. It's time. We, we it's time for have, all of us. We don't have any of that stuff. Yeah. Get one. Get a band yeah. camp. Get a band. Well, we have right uh, back here. Yeah. And let's uh let's let's sell some some uh, music. You know well, what I mean? Well, if you if you want to support us, um, you could buy the album on iTunes or something like that. Or Amazon. Uh, it's available Amazon, on yeah. iTunes yeah mm -hmm. it's on uh, everything um we also have you know a venmo if you're feeling super generous and you want to um help us out cool, with the, cool, cool. the cost of production and yeah, stuff like that we have a link tree yeah i'm do. sure you know what that is i do um, in fact i have on one myself instagram. yeah it's on our instagram or, well sorry it's not on our instagram we should put it there oh. we're Please you know, do. yeah Here's a fun oh. fact about the album while we're talking about this. Like we don't get together very often. We probably got together four, maybe five times in the course of recording the album. Wow. We would just send stuff back and forth. Cause I, at the time I was living in Odessa, which is a good 30 mile drive North of here. And, cool. um, and we're both pretty busy. So a lot of the work and I would work in libraries a lot of times when I moved into the van, <laughs> moved out into the van i would um no i get public it library. Yeah. so um yeah. and then we would get together to to record something and then part ways for another week or so um yeah so well, that that's why we, we we're not always together on stuff like this you know 
Well, that's cool. I mean, I actually, I do think that's cool. You know, it's like, uh, actually, you know, that is really kind of uh, a magic that we all have to learn, you know, how to stay in touch, you know, where, you know, mm -hmm. you know, thing, things ebb and flow sometimes, you know, it's like people are, people are busy sometimes. My co-host is busy sometimes, you know, <laughs> just something yeah. I have to deal with. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. Uh -huh. So look, uh, Cerulean Sunday, they're on Instagram at Cerulean Sunday Music. Um, guys, throw the link to your iTunes up on there um, and uh, figure out a T-shirt. Uh, let's 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 get it going. Let's make some stuff happen. Yeah. Um, I will say to the effect of, uh, you know, trying to cook and, and, uh, um, and, uh, sort of my lifestyle getting in the way I, uh, I had a 12 month lease on a, on an apartment that was like pretty cool, but, uh, I had a tough time dealing with my roommates and, <laughs> you know, like, oh, yes. I, yeah. And, and, uh, and it was very drafty, honestly, Mark, like. <laughs> You are probably warmer and comfier in your van in Florida than I was uh, here in Connecticut. Definitely warm. <laughs> yeah. Goodness warm. gracious. At least you were warm. Yeah. You know? yeah. yeah. So uh, don't yeah. miss that. I'll tell you, man, I've, I've been dying yeah. for some cold weather. Yeah. Well, you know, next week, <laughs> next week, it's going to be 52 50. degrees. I knew you were going to uh, say 50 something. It's gonna, I knew it. It's going to be so nice because it's been, well, the weather actually lately has been absolutely gorgeous. It hasn't gone over 80 and it's been right like, on. Yeah. So it's been like 75, you know, all that gorgeous, you know, cooler nights, cooler evenings, stuff like that. So, and then it's, it, it poured today yeah just it dumped like, rain on us for yeah, a solid hour there was a uh, big storm there you go. today um, <laughs> there you yeah go. I actually this morning I was coming home I had a, a lift pick me up and um I, I oh. had to like wade through like a foot of water to get into oh, the car wow. oh wow <laughs> it was uh. like, and I'm just like soaking wet and of yeah. course he's got the <laughs> AC blasting uh. and it's like it's like a 45 minute drive home <laughs> and it's pouring oh my god wow that was uh, yeah. that was great uh <laughs> that was that was very funny that's really good <laughs> all right um so i don't have a very good segue for that but uh <laughs> why don't you guys uh pick a fun restaurant in st petersburg and and we will have to close it up unfortunately um you until know, next time all right awesome. i don't know all if right. i've eaten out in st pete no. at all I, I, I mean I've good been, for you man well i mean it's <laughs> but explain because i thought you said you couldn't cook in your van well yeah <laughs> i go to walmart and i get cans of beans and rotisserie chickens like that's well, that that's like the actually, only warm meal i get in a, every once in a while that is uh there's an element to that that is totally completely awesome but uh let's <laughs> <laughs> now but, um, I'm... yeah well, I can speak for this one cafe that Emma turned me on to oh, yeah. called Chris Lip. Is that how you say it? Yeah. Okay. Chris Lip, Chris Chris Lip, Lip cafe. cafe. And it's dope. It's it's out of a super vibe and it's chill. It's beautiful down there. It's in it's along the it's right on Central Avenue. Yeah. So it's right downtown. Oh, wow. It's nice shops yeah. and everything. So I would that's that's the best I can do. For a uh, for a restaurant restaurant, I um when I first cool. when I first moved into my apartment, um cool. I asked my roommate where oh, there's a good place to eat and he was like, "Well, I work at this place ceviche um oh, and wow. it's right on the pier, so it's right on uh on the water and it's a it's a Spanish restaurant and they have wow. I love I love Spanish food. So they have Same. like awesome charcuterie boards and just like little it's a tapas bar and great. um they have great cocktails stuff like that so i literally that's where i go like i take dates there i like, I just, yeah. like i'll yeah. take my friends there anytime i'm needing a place to go to eat in downtown that's where i go so can i ask you something mm -hmm. when when you're uh on a date at ceviche right and maybe you have a feeling like, like maybe you don't have to pay for this meal. 
did you ever just go, I'm fucking getting the, you know, the tuna something something? You know um, what I mean? <laughs> did you say tuna? <laughs> tuna <laughs> something. Tuna's um, never expensive, well, right? You know, tuna's actually, like thirteen dollars tops, yeah. but you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> actually, to be honest, um, I I suffer from anxiety, especially around like dating and relationships so okay i have major anxiety when i go out to eat (laughs) with a date and so i can't really eat a whole lot anyway but um, oh wow so i'm i'm kind of a cheap date (laughs) because i'll just order like i'll order like one (laughs) tapas that's why i like going there that's why i like going there though is because i can get away with just ordering one little thing and that's fine. I, I don't have to like take leftovers with me or, you know, so. All that's, right. You heard it here first, folks. Singer, songwriter, <laughs> Emma Converse is a cheap date. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, I'm a, I'm even cheaper. <laughs> I could be the cheapest date eggs. out of all three of you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I won't have more than two drinks. I'm like, just, I Good. don't know. I don't actually, you know, that's actually a sticking point for me. I'm not saying like you, you, but like, I think. You know, if, if you're going out on a date, two drinks is like that's that's where it's at. Yeah, and no, I don't don't. And um... if you don't eat much, they work better. Yeah, yeah. so we go, do a set... exactly. <laughs> wow, uh, thanks for going down on that, guys. That was actually pretty fun. <laughs> okay, you know, I know we kind of, you know, it's sort of you're testing the waters here, or whatever. But um, I do appreciate you guys being game. That was actually of really course. fun. Um, we do have a segment called Best Plates Under Twenty Seven Dollars. Um, I think I'm gonna keep that in our back pocket. You guys should come back and we'll, and we'll play mm-hmm. the game. Best plates under twenty seven dollars. You just try and figure out a meal at your favorite restaurant for less than twenty seven dollars. But tip your tip can go over the twenty seven. That's the rule that we've made. Um, okay. okay. Right. So uh, I guess we have to sadly call call it here. But is there anything else you guys uh, want to add? Want to throw in? Hmm stay tuned stay tuned please it's the lemon yeah. Drop sessions yeah and, hey like um you could uh <clears throat> you could check us out on our social media i think we only have like instagram but yeah um yeah. and and we would we would love some feedback like uh if people want to hear us cover some tunes or whatever or maybe yeah. like we really want to post more and we need to get together more in order to do that but um you know if, if people want to give us some some feedback or, or help us like yeah. uh you know figure out what to do next we would we wouldn't mind that at all and if you want yes. if you're curious yeah. and you want to um check us out individually we both have a lot of our own music on our individual instagrams right There's right this, what markatroid 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 and markatroid mine, i have a specific one called emma kiara music so cool cool yeah. we will have all sorts of links um attached to this interview um Sweet. so so don't even worry about it um we're gonna close it up it's the lemon drop sessions um please do stay tuned um great to chat with cerulean sunday um happy holidays to all of our mutual listeners happy yeah. holidays. thank you so much for having us this was yeah. uh, this was fun this it was